It hasn't been a question I've been asking manufacturers the last few years. But there's a lot of pushback on that, and it's a very slow process. I go to start design on a new project. Should I be looking at that the same way I've been looking at that for the last year, two years, five years? Or do I need to now start coming into this, learning the lessons from these current interactions with past clients, and reevaluate some of how I'm using the tools in my designer toolbox? And ask manufacturers these questions more. And I think in some ways too, the word replaceable was chosen carefully because when you use the word modularity, right, that kind of brings some notions that make people react <laughs> strongly. Um, and if you use the word standardization, right, that's like the stick and in some ways, you know, there's a lot of feedback, like that's what we need to do, but there's a lot of pushback on that. And it's a very slow process. And so I think even like the first step of like, hey, as an industry, can we move forward in defining like, what does it mean to have a replaceable component? And even like, how easy is easy? These are some of the things we even talked about with when it came to controls, right? Like, oh, easy to commission, but it's like, okay, so what is, what is a replaceable component? We really, we're leaving it broad for now, but I think it needs to mature a little bit in that regard of like, okay, what are we really talking about when we say that?